History is being made this morning. Judge Katanji Brown Jackson's Supreme Court nomination hearings are getting underway today. And if confirmed, she would be the first black woman on the nation's highest court. And a new Monmouth University poll just out suggests Americans back her appointment by a two to one margin. Our congressional correspondent, Rachel Scott. Well, where do we find her today? She is actually inside that hearing room. Good morning to you, Rachel. TJ, good morning. And history will be made in this room today in just a few hours when Judge Katanji Brown Jackson sits in this chair behind me to begin her confirmation hearings as the very first black woman nominated to serve on the Supreme Court. And for the first time since the pandemic began, 60 members of the public will also rotate in and out of this room. They'll have a chance to witness this history unfold. The hearings will take place over the course of the next four days, starting today with opening statements from the 22 members of the Senate Judiciary Committee as well well as an opening statement from Judge Jackson herself that will be followed on Tuesday and Wednesday by an intense round of questioning Judge Jackson her record will be in the spotlight the White House already having to defend her against Republican attacks claiming that she is soft on crime and attacking her record as a public defender of course she has been through the confirmation process before she was confirmed to the DC Circuit with the support of three Republicans but TJ there is no guarantee any of them will support her this time around but as we talk about it potentially uh, new justice. We have word that a current justice, uh, Justice Thomas, is actually in the hospital. What's the latest? Yeah, and Justice Thomas will actually miss some of the oral arguments this week. The Supreme Court announced that he's been in the hospital since Friday, recovering from an infection. We are told this is not related to COVID-19 and that he's expected to be released in the next day or two, TJ. All right, Rachel Scott, thank you for that. We want folks to know you can tune in to ABC News this afternoon for special live coverage of Judge Jackson's confirmation hearings, and you can watch continuing coverage of the hearing beginning at 11 a.m. on our streaming service, ABC News Live. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.